got a chain here now. We put it on a flat table like this and try and make a circle. We'll most commonly find a couple of loop knots like this. This loop knot is on the outside of the chain circle and the other loop knot is on the inside of the circle. So we take one loop knot and pull the top of the chain over the second loop knot. That'll remove the first loop knot and it will put another loop knot there. So they're side to side, but they're both facing out of the chain. That's the important part. At this stage, both loop knots should be a mirror image of each other. They show if we were to take a look at the top, they roll outwards like that, away from each other. We take each loop knot like this, one in each hand, and then we pull back on the top chain, the one that's rolled over the top of the bottom chain, and we keep pulling until it's right over the bottom one. Once we've done that, We've got a chain there that has no knots at all. 